But yeah, I mean, what, the beginning of Yellow Jackets, it starts out with after they had their big munch fest. Mm-hmm. And it just yeah, shows like... I, I love that. That was my favorite scene. They all got naked and had a munch fest. <laughs> <laughs> Were they naked? Except for the gay guy with one leg. They, he didn't, he didn't yeah. watch from behind the tree. <laughs> yeah. Clearly, he's, um, you know, an outsider now. He's going to be set up to uh, be the next, I think, meal. Oh, yeah, he's yeah. He's eating. Yeah, yeah everybody was like, he's losing. And what's wrong? It's like, dude, you're the, he's he's the only one that hasn't eaten anything in like two weeks, and you're asking him what's wrong, and everybody's bopping around with. Him. Yeah, that one chick, she was like, whenever he started having that hallucination, and she was like, are you hungry? And she's looked all like a demon and whatever and was coming at him and stuff. So that was a trip. But um, um, yeah, what's her face when she was puking and she goes, what did we do? She was like. You ate her face. <laughs> you know, how about when Shauna uh, Melanie Linsky was uh, she was going to retrieve her uh, you know her suburban mom car and she told the guy you know what the trouble with peeling people's skin off is that <laughs> you have to roll it up and give it a good yank that guy was like pissing his pants. <laughs> she was, was badass. She was like just just take the car. I'm yeah, sorry. Car. Yeah. Yeah, the brother or the her husband, he's such a wuss. It's like she had him dead to rights, had the gun drawn on him, and then you bumped her out of the way. Jonna. Well, his his wussness started way before that. Yeah. Did it was it me or did Vanessa's forehead get bigger this episode? It seems like it's growing. <laughs> Vanessa which one is Vanessa? Vanessa's uh, the one that got attacked by the wolf. Oh, Van, yes. Yeah, I do yeah. think it is it does look bigger. Maybe it's the scars. I don't know. Uh, or it's the uh, the uh, the area there. I the lot there was supernatural stuff this time, but I I I didn't have time to watch any other recap shows, so I just kind of just watched the episode. Uh, I mean, it just seems like that whatever that hell that symbol is. Yes, it has some kind of power over Kai. Yeah, and it draws her out at nighttime, and she's looking for that eyeless dude that's just wandering in the woods. And yep. it showed that she's been seeing him since she was a kid. Not way before any of this stuff happened in the woods, because she showed her with her grandmother, and she was seeing him in the mirror. Yeah, it's, it's hereditary with her. I don't know. Mm-hmm. Are we going to figure it out this year, or is it going to be like lost, and it'll be like six seasons and be awful at the end? <laughs> Probably. Yeah. I, I don't think they'll go six seasons. I don't, I don't think they got enough. I don't think they have. I don't think there's enough meat on the bone, pardon the pun, <laughs> yes. to go six seasons. Yeah, Jackie's all gone now. She's just a skeleton. <laughs> They could have made Butter of the Gods if they had just taken her thigh bones and sawed them in half and then roasted <laughs> them. And he well, that's, didn't one of them say that? One of them was Misty. like, can we just take the bones and make some soup? And they were all, oh, that was so good. Yeah, Misty's <laughs> like friend, she was saying, you know, we could have made a broth. I mean, they all got upset about it, but we could have, and it would have been good. Not good, but you know. <laughs> it happened to the people that died in the crash. Are they still on the plane or they already buried them? They buried them. Yeah, because it was warm. Yeah. With the coach, yeah, because remember they had to dig up the coach to get the ring, so all the rest of them were were already buried. And I, I guess have... that was the coach's plan, or the Ben's plan was to put the bones with the rest of the bodies, and that way, once we get rescued, we can say that she just died mm-hmm. in the crash. And you know, he's tr- he's still trying to play Mister. You know, I've got good ideas. I'm going to look out for you. You know, just please don't eat me. I wish I was yeah. still living with my gay boyfriend and never came on this way. I just wanted to ask um, any of you grill masters, have you ever thought about just uh, taking a big glob of uh, snow and put it on top of your steak and yeah, letting it well. just cook for hours? We, t- we talked about that a little last week, how they well, blanched, they blanched Jackie right right before they served her. <laughs> you know, you don't, you can part, I would eat. <laughs> <laughs> you need some sloppy steaks. That's yes. the best way to make sloppy steaks out in the middle of nowhere. Throw but, her, snow on. but her jacket, because remember, she didn't want to give up her jacket or her clothes. Yeah. So did that stuff just cook into her? It either burnt off or cooked into her. Yeah. We were, and they wouldn't have taken it off, remember, because they didn't, uh, Shauna didn't want anybody to see that she had been sampling her arm for a couple of weeks before they finally got rid of her. I was just taking a little bite. <laughs> Uh, yeah. It looks to me in the cast list that there's an adult van, so maybe we'll get to see her. Yeah, it's yeah, the chick so... from Six Feet Under. Yeah, yeah Lauren, Lauren Ambrose. Ambrose. Yeah. yeah, she should be in the next episode because that's where that's where Ty is going. Remember whenever she saw that reflection of herself in the mirror? Yeah, and it was telling her where to go, and she didn't get it, and then she had to be like, and make the scar thing saying go to On her, her or whatever. 
So that's where she's going is to she's going to find Van. I would like to see a, se- a separate series of just Misty and Walter. I love their interaction. Yeah. Oh my God, poor Randy. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Whenever he slapped him, he was like, dude. Yeah. <laughs> I, was, dude. I was telling Jeff, I was like, that reminded me of the scene from the first season of True Detective when they tucked that guy out on the houseboat just to yeah. try to get the, you know, try to muscle him. Yeah. yeah. It was very similar, except, you know, their version of it where he's yeah. afraid to slap him and. I must sit here and make little people out of beer cans. <laughs> That's what I'm do. And then what was the deal with the Lottie? Was she hallucinating? Obviously she was hallucinating. Yeah. Oh, the bees. Or oh, she's having visions. I think it's different than hallucinations. She oh, has yeah. actual visions because she's like clairvoyant. People mm-hmm. are saying that her, her friend there that she is always with is maybe not real. What friend? Her the one friend that came up and talked to her right with the oh, bees yeah. at the end. Yeah. Okay. Well... Well, she explained. People are people are looking at all stuff. the people are looking at all the different interactions she's had with the other girls, and apparently there's not that many. Mm. Well, uh, next episode is next week. Um, but here's a show note: Are we going to continue talking about this, or are we going to do Barry? I think we should do Barry. I bet. Let's see, let's see what the Patreon say. I bet they'll all vote for Barry. Yeah, yeah. You could do a little poll on the Patreon uh, thing as one of the options for the message. So yeah, just put a poll on there and. Best two out of three will get it. <laughs> you can do a poll on Patreon, Barry or Yellow Jackets. All right. And then our first episode will have to be a recap episode. So we got to talk about last season. So somebody can do that. I'm not good at work. Mm, that was yummy. Sorry. The honeycomb. Yes. Honeycomb. Won't you be? Baby, now honeycomb. Be my own. All right. So that's our recap episode. Tell all your friends. <laughs>